Uh, my business is Unique Travel Services, and my audience is families, both traditional and untraditional, who want to travel uh, to all inclusives in the Caribbean and specifically the uh, Mexico, um, Jamaica, and Dominican Republic for now. So I was a little lost <laughs> as to, is, to what to do. <laughs> <laughs> so I I bought into this travel business. Um, the reason why I bought it is I was just looking to make a little extra money. Um, I tried two things that totally wasn't for me, didn't work. But this I actually enjoy, and it doesn't feel like a job for me. So I was like, great. My my oldest son, he was going to college, and you know I didn't want him to to have like a lot of loans. And so I was just really looking to pick up some extra money. But then when I got into it, I was like, hey, I can really make this work. But the problem was I had been recruited by some who could only help me with the network marketing portion but they could not help me with the travel portion and it was like I got very limited answers and there was no support for the travel side except for oh we have a million trainings online you know and I'm like well that's nice but <laughs> But if I got a client asking me for all of these things, like I need, like there's some steps that, I, that I'm missing, you know? And so that was missing for me. So I'm like, okay. And so I need some clients. Like, how do I get those, you know? And so it was just, I'm like, I have the tools to make the money, but there's something missing. And so I started following you on social media. I started uh, with the, the Wednesday nights like like Tay. Um, and then you and I had a conversation and I was like, hey, I'm ready. Let's let's do this. You know, like something has to give. And then after that, I was just all in. For me, I had no idea what I was getting myself into. I just knew that I'm, I'm buying into this program like I, I needed to work. And so, you know, I, it was like the unknown for me what I was walking into. And it ended up being so much more than I could have ever expected. I think at first we were only supposed to do like eight weeks and then you were like, yeah, we're going till December. And I was like, oh, <laughs> Lord. <laughs> You gave us your all. You gave us yes, everything yes. that you that you had. Definitely. And I appreciated that. You know, Jerry yes, said yes. you care. You absolutely do care. You would jump on a one-on-one, -on -one, you know, if, if I needed it. Uh, you were there to, to support. Um, always you were informative. Um, I didn't feel like it was a bunch of fluff. I didn't feel like you sold me a video and then right. you weren't there anymore. And so I went in. And I, it was like, Ugh, because, you know, it was the unknown for me, but you made it comfortable for me once I got into it. You know, you pushed me out of my comfort zone, but you, it, it, yes. it was comfortable to, 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 to do the, the course and to say, OK, I got this. I can do this. I can absolutely do it. And I had a new swag. I'm like, yeah, I'm an online travel boss. I'm going to say I hated that challenge. However. <laughs> However, it did just what it was oh, supposed to do. Nicole being the winner of the challenge. Yes. <laughs> she won the challenge. The challenge did not just show up. Like, there was flagging it. You know, there was like, there was a major incentive to, to do it. And Nicole, like, won the challenge. So, yeah, please, she did very well. I'm sorry, Nicole. <laughs> Thank you. Well, listen, I was like, I'm all in. I paid for the program, which she told me to do, I'm going to do. So that's what I did. And although it paid me to show up every day, uh, you know, with, with my audience, it did help me to build that relationship with my audience, which ultimately led to the success I have today. Um, so, you know, it pushed me out of my comfort zone, but it did yield the results. Marketing is so much more than I ever expected. I ever, I have a newfound respect for anybody in marketing. Um, and there's so many different aspects of, of marketing that, that you can touch. It's not just putting up a, a post and thinking that you, you're going to sell it that way. Um, for me, uh, what helped a lot was becoming my product. So I did the traveling, um, you know, and so that attracted clients because they're like, hey, maybe it is safe to go there. You know, I showed them the different protocols that was going on. Uh, 
and then I had people calling me and saying, yeah, can you book a trip? Or, you know, I never would have traveled had you not posted that video, you know, when you were wherever you, you were. Um, so just finding different ways to, to market. And then the other thing is you always uh, encourage us to know our numbers. Um, you know, like if you, if you want to leave that full-time job, how, you know, what's that number? What's your number that you're, that you're going to need to, to do that? And then back yourself into a plan uh, in order to accomplish that goal. Uh, I can go. I'm, I'm already uh, supporting a team. I love to teach, so I'm already supporting a team. I support people who's not even on my on my team. Um, I'm working with you, you know, as a client success coach. So I'm definitely, <laughs> so I'm definitely um, enjoying that. Um, earlier this year, I completed my first group trip, which was a 43 people to Jamaica. So I was so excited um, that it, it went off without a hitch. And so I want to double those numbers for my next group. Trip. Trip. Uh, so I just got to get the flyer out. I have the dates and, and everything, um, but I have a June of 2022 and June 2023 trip. One of Punta Cana and the other one is I'm going to do to Dubai. Um, so there are two totally different types of trips. So I feel like I'm challenging myself <laughs> to, to do those trips and uh, get them out and get them running in Dubai. I pushed it so far out because I really, really want to play that one up um, and because it's going to be such a different type of experience. So I'm really challenging my myself with that. Uh, so that's the, the big things on my list for right now. I'm gonna say abso absolutely. Um, I'm just gonna run down some some highlights, some successes, real, really quick. Um, I wanted to grow six figures in sales um, by June of this year, um, based on what I've learned from Sunday's program uh, and the action that I took. I reached that goal in early May, so that was great. So then. Um, I found out because I they, they have a saying that relationship is the new the, the new currency and I wholeheartedly believe that mm -hmm. um, because I used a certain supplier for probably about 95% of, of my bookings and because of that relationship they made me a VIP agent which got my um, clients certain perks like they can you know they they can instead of the 45 day mark they can have up until 30 days before departure to pay or if the the price changes where they no, normally won't change it they'll change it for me um, but it's different things that they allow them to do and different perks that they give me for being a VIP agent and then um, I was notified I think probably two weeks ago that I was a top selling agent for my hosts. Um, and so they invited me to, to a retreat and I could bring, bring somebody for five days, five star resort. Uh, you know, and it's, it's going to be some training. It's going to be some site ins inspections and you're going to have some time to just in, enjoy the resort. So, um, it, you know, those successes I would not have had, had I not built certain relationships, had I not taken the program, it gave me the jump start that I needed in order to be successful.